Good morning! Look at this downpour. Literally 10 seconds ago, this light wasn't on and it was just cloudy. That's crazy. Oh, what's that? <laughs> We've been listening to Maroon 5 Sugar all morning today and we rewatched the video like three times because it's an awesome video. And I can't imagine what it's like at the stadium or oh around the area. Gosh. Everyone's tailgating probably it's since like 7 in the morning. It's down though right now. I know, and the game is in about an hour, so it's going to be... Wow, look at that. Anyway, that retail shop that's right across our hotel is Free People, which is insane because I love Free People clothes. I've been loving their clothes since five years ago when I saw them on Karma Loop, and I never knew they had freestanding stores. I've only seen them at Nordstrom and a few like boutiques but never a freestanding store so we're gonna go there before we go home how's that chicken or i mean duck <laughs> it's definitely not chicken we ended up ordering pizza last night at like midnight we ordered one for amy and julian too but i think they were already sleeping by then so there's a whole nother pizza in here about to go breakfast we're here at the pike place market most dead I've ever seen it on a Sunday. No, it's the crazy because, because everybody's because getting ready to go watch field, the game. Yeah. Our favorite hotel in Seattle. Thanks, Ian, for letting us stay here. If you guys are thinking about coming to Seattle, you guys want to be right next to the Pike Place Market. Probably the most famous touristy spot in Seattle. Totally go to in at the market. Oh, they have this really cool um, cooking store right next to the in at the market. What? So when I worked downtown, uh -huh. uh, one of my co-workers worked part-time here, and at the end of the night, whatever was left over, she would bring to the oh. store, and it was the best pastries. Oh yeah, the totally the best pastry. Oh honey, totally. Look at all this. Wow, look at all those sandwiches. That's what I remember eating in France. Baguette, cheese, meat, butter, that's it. Ooh, Nelle. This is probably one of my favorite desserts, at least French desserts. This one looks like apricot. We got apple back there. Is this peach? Oh yeah, peach. Pear. Woo. Oh, Marion Berry. Babe, how is that? Is that awesome? It's warm. It's kind of gooey. Really heavy mushroom flavor, which obviously you would expect from a mushroom. What? What is that called anyways? Pastry. This is one of our favorite spots to go to, Baco. Orange lemon lime. Oh, ah, that's a little sour. The ah, guys across the street are looking at me like, what's this guy doing holding up the camera? He's like, is he taking like a million selfies right now? If only you could see their face. They're like, what is he doing? Is he talking to his own camera? I want to see what they do when they pass me. Is this like heaven for you right now? Is this your favorite section at Nordstrom's come to life? It is. Okay, that looks so cute. This is like a fairyland of Judy clothes. Oh, they got lingerie over there. <laughs> Fresh squeezed. It tastes like just like lemonade. This little top seems a little awkward because, I don't know, it just seems a little low. But probably would look sexy on Judy. Yeah, it's so cute, and you're cute. I just want to make love. To the lady was really nice. She's like, "You can sit down." I like it when stores have a place for the men to sit. Cool. Sure. I don't know if I told you, but we're having an additional 20% off of sale. Off sale. Uh oh. Oh wait, off everything? No, just off sale. Oh wow. Oh, yeah, but he has some like really amazing sweaters on. It. Wow, okay. she loves that. She loves to save money. <laughs> How long has this store been here for? About like two, maybe three years. And this was supposed to be a really short shopping trip. And, uh, this is a short sh shopping trip. Okay. Judy gave me shit about wanting to uh, watch a game or go to the game today. Because she wanted to get back to the girls. 
But if shopping's involved, we can put it on home. I'm not arguing with you, honey. If you want to go shopping at this place, that'll still be here, you know, next week. Okay, ten minutes, honey. Ten minutes. We've been here for at least half an hour. You, you tell me, how long would it take to get out? To go, what? How long oh, would it uh, take? honey, well, you didn't have to go to the game. Well, I would have just Whoa. gone. I would have just gone. Anyway, I see. Still sitting here in this cool little chair that's really low. And it's only been two minutes. Okay, it's been 30 minutes, honey. Whatever. It's like time stops when girls go shopping. But for guys, it's like... What's that again, honey? Oh, this is a sweater I get lots of compliments on. It's What's on that? Sale right now. <laughs> so is that why we're here longer than three minutes? Yeah. <laughs> Having fun? Yeah. Being so patient, I really appreciate it. It's um 15 minutes. And I don't mind at all, but I just comfy the clothes are, you know? I just wanna uh, I just want this go on record that I was patient. Maybe some brownie points here. Yes, honey, thank you. Cause guess what I'm guess what I'm missing right now? I'm about to miss the game here. Looking for more. What what else? You looked at the whole store. This isn't even that big of a store. Oh, really? Seriously? Does anybody stand her, her leg? Are those called gauchos? I don't know. It's Benji's turn. We're gonna grab some coffee and then we're heading home. This is like a really cool cafe. So I'm totally missing the game right now, which I don't mind. Uh, I'm, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna watch it. Uh, listen to the restaurant on the radio. Somebody was watching it outside and they came in here and yelled out what just happened. There was an interception. Okay. So, even though I'm not watching the game, I know what's going on. Oh my god, I'm dying right now because Auntie Mel Mel and Auntie Val have been posting photos of Mia, Kira, and Juliana wearing their Seahawks gear. It's so cute. So, I'm going to repost the photo. It's so adorable. So, we're listening to the game on the radio and it's not looking too good. I don't understand what's going on, but Benji's like, oh, oh. are watching the game. Juliana's having the mushroom pastry. Is it Nami? Yeah. I'm glad yeah. you like it. What is that on the TV? <laughs> football. Are you wearing your football dress? That's from Nina and Kate. <laughs> like pastries. You love mushrooms like mommy? Yes. <laughs> Were you a good girl? Yes. I love you. <laughs> Hi, girls. They're like, Mom, the hugs are losing. Come here. Want to take a picture with Daddy? Come on. Mom, can I see This is so cute. Look, they're so happy in your hands. I love that I have a Seahawks cheerleader to help me root on the Seahawks. <laughs> but she's disappointed in the score right now. <laughs> do, do, do. <laughs> do, 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 do. Uh uh. No thanks. Okay. Okay, go. So somehow Kira keeps finding all the little can honey, you need to take it from her right now because she's That's legal? Oh, yeah. 
Oh, oh. I'm eating, I'm eating, mommy. All right, what are you eating? Breakfast. Breakfast? Yes. Very cool. Go get your spoon in your kitchen. Booya, in your face, Green Bay. In your face. One thing I don't like about football so much is like how people put other people's teams down. Well, I guess, I don't know, I just, ugh. It bugs me. I mean, it's one thing to have pride in your in your team, but to be like in your face, like you know. Anyway. Like that. Like that. Oh, in your you face like, like that. Like yeah, I don't like trash talk. And T. Val said this is the first time she legit felt that Kira looked like a boy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's like two minutes left in the game and it's super intense. Like, I'm starting to get into it. <laughs> what is up with this girl? What is it? Oh, oh, I... Baby sad. Baby sad? Oh, she, you know what? I think she wants a banana. Okay, thank you. Here. Is this all you wanted? Oh yeah. We got it. We got the ball. We what? got the ball. Yeah. We got the ball. <laughs> we got the ball. We got the ball. We got the ball. We got the ball. Oh my gosh. That is so. That is game changer. Wait, let me see this. Literally oh. game changer. Oh. Game Was it Kears? No, not Kears. Oh. So we're we're kicking the ball because we just scored a touchdown. It's supposed to be Green Bay's ball, and now we got it back right from the get-go. Oh my gosh. This is intense. Oh my god. If we win this, it's going to be legendary. It will literally be like one of the best comebacks for Seattle. Because it's back to the so back close Super Bowl? Or? If, they, if they got the ball back, they could have just ended the game. Yeah. It's going berserk on everyone. Look, Green Bay's so scared. You guys are scared. Honey, stop that. <laughs> Oh, okay. <laughs> that is huge. It's really tall. It's tall. Wow! Whoa! <laughs> Try it again, yeah. <laughs> Just won the game. Our friend oh and local hero, hometown okay. hero. <laughs> he's not our friend. He's, he's our friend on Twitter, okay? <laughs> but uh, he just scored the touchdown in overtime. Which is awesome because yeah. I felt like he redeemed himself. Oh, yeah. he, he didn't do so well earlier. He had some unfortunate plays, but Seattle, we're going to Super Bowl, baby! <laughs> he was hustling to the end. Yeah, baby! Way to go, Kiers. Good for you, man. There's fireworks going off everywhere around us right now. <laughs> One, two, three, stick our sisters. And, uh, yeah! Uh, 
Oh yeah! Yeah! Oh yeah! <laughs> wow, they are playing this over and over. Mise en place. I'm gonna be cooking some pork adobo, which is a Filipino dish, and these are the ingredients. We got onions, we got soy sauce, vinegar, uh, two different types of oils, salt and pepper, bay leaf, and um, two different cuts of garlic. I actually am following a recipe that's on my Benjamin TV channel that Judy's mom helped me make uh, because she is the master of adobo and it's delicious. So this is a dish that you eat with rice. Good any time of the day, and uh, hopefully it turns out good because I haven't cooked in a while. Look at that. Oh, look at those juices. In the Philippines, they call this stuff right down here, sabao. That's what you want to put on your rice right there. Uh, we got the adobo master here. I'm gonna do a little bit of quality checking. Oh, wow. <coughs> that oh looks perfect. How's it, how's it smell? <laughs> smell? Yeah, it smells good. It smells adobo. Yeah. I use your technique of not stirring mm -hmm. when you put the vinegar put the in, and I think that makes a difference. Yeah. Stirring vinegar, you like, what's the harm in that? But there's something about it's, not stirring it. It's gonna it. be raw. It's the gonna be raw. It's gonna be raw, and yeah. then it's gonna. See, that's uh, something you only learn from years of doing it, yeah. or learning obviously from someone else, but don't stir your vinegar after putting it in. Oh, you brought mango. We'll have this for late. Ooh, this is ready. Hey, it, come on, it feels overripe. Um, it feels overripe. Mm -hmm. What do you need help with? No, she's gonna help you. You're gonna help me make green juice? She wow. saw you cut the leaves. Oh, okay. Come on, Juliana. Come on. What? Me, babe. Huh? Here. Oh, step. Rhino's gonna stay here? Yeah. Okay. Juliana, I'm gonna <laughs> wash the kale and then I need you to hold it while I put it in there, okay? Yay. You're such a good helper. Alright, Juliana, here. We got kale. Say kale. Um, Oi. Kale healthy. Yeah. Kale is healthy. Kale is healthy. Can you say good? Yeah, it is very, very healthy. Mmm, kale. Yeah. Are you my helper? Yeah. I need a kiss though for my helper. Oh, thank you. you guys watch the game though? Yeah, that was Wasn't it intense? Show. Benji always tries to master food and it's so nice to see him try Filipino food. So good. This looks like did mom's adobo. It? No, not yet. Your mom did say it. Looked... But look at this. He even put an egg in there. I love and eggs And I put Japanese adobo. salsa. So it's half boiled, but the residual heat from the adobo, I feel mm -hmm. like it mm -hmm. cooked it. Seriously starving, and this looks amazing. The Patriots are playing right now, and it looks like they're gonna win. Crazy because Benji's family is from New England, and obviously, we're here in the Seattle area, so it'll kind of be a really fun Super Bowl for the entire family. Okay, Honey, she's gonna help me today. I got a chair, she's gonna be tall enough to actually put everything in by herself. Oh without sitting my on the counter. goodness. I'll yeah, down, you're gonna yeah. stand up and gonna help daddy. Up. Don't put your hands in here, okay? Bad, okay? Ouch, ouch, okay? You have to be very careful. You ready? All right, be very careful. Adobo for you. No, it's not hot. Is it good? Yeah. Oh, it looks like Mia and Kira love daddy's adobo. I can take this just to the Philippines now. <laughs> Moment of truth. See how the flavor of this adobo is. Is it good? Is it like like a Filipino? Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> what are you thinking? Are you thinking if you're full or not? Try, mommy. You try, mom. Try what? Oh, the necklace. Thank, Thank you. you. I think that weighs cool. it more than Juliana. All right, so they're having mango, and this one's a little sour, so. Sour. Should be sour. But you love sour? Yes. You want more? JB use hat. JB use hat. JB use hat. Yeah, JB use hands. You could use your hands with that. The comment of the day. I thought it was actually. I don't know why I just laughed, but I, I'm totally not offended, and I hope that um, nobody else is. But this comment is from No Like Christy, and she writes, "I know this sounds crazy, but Mia Bear kind of looks like Pope Francis." Seahawks. 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 Seahaw